Hey guys, Paul from uh, Outer Earth here, and today I got something special in a delivery, and this is the Outer Earth package. It was sent from Hong Kong, and it's around 0.5 kilos, and it's of course the sample of Outer Earth that I need to check before the final manufacturing. So let's open this guy up and just take a peek. So here we have it. This is the sample copy. It looks really great. The print cover looks awesome. And uh, yeah, the box is nice and heavy. The back looks awesome too. Oh, mini glare. And now for the all important unwrapping. The box has a nice and glossy finish to it. I really like that. As I open it, the first things I see are a few small bags to hold the components, and also a snugly fit chipboard layout like this that you just pop out. And let's take a peek at these. So. This one just fell out, which was quite nice. Easily to punch out. So there are four of these, and each layout has a company board with a specific color, two auction paddles, and one of them has a turn order tracker, while the other ones just have some extra artwork, like so. So let's move this aside for now. As I go deeper, we got the rule book. It looks quite good. So I still need to update the files for this because after the Kickstarter update that I did, uh, I got some great feedback from you guys and uh, I'm totally implementing that or a big chunk of it. So, going even deeper, over here we got some sample cards from the V. That's another game that they uh, completed. Here we have some, or the two card decks that I'll probably open right now, just to take a peek at. So here we have all the uh, super structures and the artwork it looks great. I'll of course go more into detail and uh, take a peek at them later, but for now I'll just do a general check. So the cardstock on these guys are a bit different from what I'll be getting as the final. That's why they sent us a example over here. And this is the 300 GSM blue core paper, which is really great and awesome. Well, the ones that they sent me over here are more papery and plain. That's just for testing purposes. As I can see, the edges also come really close. So I'll probably scale the artwork a bit in and make sure that the white border has more room to do its thing. Here we got the planet cards. These look awesome too. And then we got the uh, development cards. Let's open the second deck. 
And these look quite good too. Now, the first overall look looks great. It's also got some the custom dice over here. And these are all in the colors of the company or player boards. These dice look great. So let me just punch out one of these over here. So this is the company board, one of them. And I'll use the rule book as an example. The numbers fit quite good on the side over here, like so. I don't know if you guys can see it. But yeah, I'm, I'm really happy with this actually. It, it looks awesome. And that is pretty much the unboxing. We also have a mini paper insert over here just to organize the elements once they're all popped out. Which I'm going to do right now. So it's actually a really tight fit. Uh, we got on the top layer all the auction paddles and the dice. And these are some extra components, yet again, uh, three art chips, but also a uh, player order uh, tracker. They fit perfectly right over here. And the two decks of cards are actually three, but all the cards are below these company boards over here. And a rule book on top like so. And that's it. Uh, stay tuned for getting this in the mail. I'm really excited to actually pull the trigger on the manufacturing and getting this out there. It, it looks great in my hands. I'm looking really forward to just seeing it in your hands too. So uh, yeah, take care. Have a good night.